Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Um, today's video is a holiday gift guide and I haven't done a sit down video in a really long time so a little excited. I actually ended up filming this video two days ago and the quality just wasn't good so we're recording again. But yeah, I have gift ideas for uh, a little bit of everybody and I hope this is helpful. So let's uh, get into it. So starting off with gifts that could just go for like anyone, um, we're gonna start in like I have some that are like more expensive and a little bit less expensive depending on what you're uh, looking for so so my first idea is phone accessories uh, so a phone case a pop socket I have the pop socket wallet and it like pops off my phone like that and it holds all my cards in there and it goes back phone and it also has the pop socket which I really really like um, I never have to bring a bag with me or anything else. I just have like a very simple case. But the pop socket is, I don't know, I can't get a phone without one now. I've just gotten so used to it, so I really recommend it. And you can get the pop socket accessories that go in your car or like anywhere. I used to have one in my car and I would just like pop my phone on the dashboard to like see the GPS um, and change music and that kind of thing. So it's really nice to have. The air just kicked on, so I'm really sorry if the audio changed. Uh, but I'm just gonna keep going and hope for the best. Um, yeah, along with that, you can get a phone case. I recommend the ones from Case Defy. They're super cute, super customizable. Um, I personally don't have one, but I really, I've been eyeing them and they look really great. And you can, again, you can customize it to be anything and they're super durable. So I, that's what I would recommend. <laughs> so my next thing is a portable charger. Actually, my roommate last year got me one that I um, absolutely love. I bring it with me everywhere. I travel with it. I put it in my backpack when I go to classes and I think I'm going to be there too long. I take it to Disney or like theme parks when I want to, like when I go there. It fits in my pocket. She got me one that's literally like a little smaller than my phone and it's flat. So like it slips in your pocket or your bag and it like takes up no space. But my favorite thing about it is it has like the cord attached to the portable charger so I don't have to carry a cord for my phone when I have it, which game changer. So I'm gonna try to find one that's similar and I'll link it down below for you guys. The next thing I would recommend is um, an AirPod case. Now they have AirPods, great, just, you know, there's a ton of really cute cases. In, if you're feeling stockings, you could probably find one that's like a perfect stocking stuffer price. But if they don't have AirPods already and you wanna like do a little more, you could totally get them AirPods. We actually got our roommate them last year. We all kind of just went in on them for her birthday. Um, and it like equaled out to being like about what we all were gonna spend anyway. And I think AirPods are amazing. I wear mine all the time. And honestly, if mine were to break tomorrow, I'd go buy AirPods tomorrow. <laughs> we're just gonna keep going with the Apple products. My next idea is an Apple Watch or an Apple Watch, watch band. So I got my Apple Watch last Christmas and I wear this thing every day. <laughs> every day. <laughs> um, I love it. It tracks my workouts. It tracks my activity. It uh, encourages, me, encourages me to stay active. And then it also gets my texts, my calls, etc. But again, if that might be a little bit pricey for your budget, then you can totally go for an Apple Watch band. Um, I know mine's getting a little like monkey and they do get dirty after a while and need to be replaced. My next overall idea is like a smart TV stick. So um, for example, our TV up here, you can't really see it, <laughs> but it wasn't a smart TV so we ended up getting a fire stick for it and I really don't think they're that expensive. I think they're like range from like $20 to like $75 depending on what you want. But you can get a Fire Stick, you can get a Roku Stick, they also have the Apple TV. I'm not sure what other ones they have, but those are the ones that I know. I know for me personally, I don't use cable anymore. I like rely on my smart TV because I only use like Netflix, YouTube, Hulu, all the streaming services. So as long as your friend has Wi-Fi and a TV that's not a smart TV, boom, you got a great gift. Another thing that could be a little bit more expensive is a really nice coat or jacket. If you live up north or your friend or your family member lives up north, a nice jacket can be really nice. I 
personally just bought one from Polister. I will put it here and I'll also link that down below, but I'm so excited. I am planning to move up north when I graduate school, so I'm looking for a job up north right now. I bought this jacket and I'm so excited to be able to wear it in the winter. It's so cute and it's definitely like a warm, warm jacket. Another thing you could do that's a little bit pricier is a nice pair of shoes. Um, I personally have been eyeing like the Nike Air Force Ones or the Nike Blazers. Uh, but you could do whatever shoes you think your friend would like. You could even do like more going out shoes. I think a nice sneaker is a great like everyday shoe. I wear my sneakers all the time. I actually have Converse right now that I wear like every day and I um, definitely wear those into the ground. So uh, if you can get somebody a nice pair of like good, cute like shoes. You're golden. And actually, the two that I recommended are great for any anybody. And my last like expensive idea is a plane ticket. So if your friend or family member is not in the same area as you, and you've been wanting to see them, uh, you can just buy them a plane ticket to come see you. I think anybody who wants to travel, or if you really wanted a big wallet, you could buy your friend and you a, a plane ticket to go somewhere together. I mean, it's a Christmas gift to yourself too, so like, hey. Honestly, it just depends on what your budget is, but you can find really cheap tickets online, depending on when you look and where you look and if, all that. And if you guys want me to make a whole video about how to find cheap plane tickets or like travel deals, let me know. I might make it anyway, but like, I have a lot of tricks and tips up my sleeve for that, so let it grow. Alright, so going more into. Uh, like more categorized gifts. These ones were more girl-aimed gifts, but again, like they can go for anybody that you think might like them. Nice jewelry is obviously a nice gift. I have found some cute jewelry at Forever 21 if you're looking for something that's not super expensive or out of your budget. That is like cheaper jewelry, obviously, so it's more like not all the time wear, but if you wanted to go a little bit more expensive, I know you can find some nice pieces that like TJ Maxx or like even Forever. If they have a lot of jewelry already, you could get them a nice jewelry holder, uh, like organizer thing. Um, I my next gift idea um, for this is for the bath. If your friend likes to take baths, I 100% recommend getting them like a bath pillow and or a bath tray. I got our roommate last year a bath tray. She's a big bath person. That was fantastic. She loved it. I borrowed it once and I loved it. It's just so nice. You can put it on the bath and you can like watch your favorite show or do your homework or like put your wine glass or like your juice on it. Um, or read a book or like you can just chill out in the bath and have like a nice, like nice time. I think a bath pillow and the tray would just like elevate the whole bath experience. And then another like shower, for me it's like a shower essential now are shower shelves. I bought my shower shelves about a year ago. And when I tell you I'm obsessed with them, I'm obsessed. Uh, no, but seriously, they are fantastic. I stuck them to my wall and they just like are there and everything fits on them. They're organized. It has a slot for my razor. Amazing, amazing. I used to have like a little shower caddy that like went over the like shower head thing. The thing would like tilt back and forth it was so annoying. Okay, so the last thing in this section that I have, and this is actually like, literally, not that I think about it, anybody could like want this, is a really nice bar set. I've seen some really like pretty ones that you could like put on like a bar cart. Personally, I'm not a bartender, but I think it'd be really fun to learn how to make really fun cocktails. So I thought it'd be fun to buy like a bar set and like maybe a little like recipe book and learn to make some really cool cocktails. I think it'd be fun to have people over Buy this for people who are of age, please, and thank you. Getting into the guy section. So, brothers, dads, boyfriends, just friends that are guys. Um, again, a lot of these can be for anybody too. So, so for the guys, my uh, roommate Cassidy suggested underwear, and specifically from Tommy Hilfiger. Um, I mean, who doesn't need underwear, if I'm being honest? The next thing is a watch. You can give them a really nice watch. I, again, I'm obsessed with my Apple Watch. I was never a watch person before I got it. So that's like my suggestion, but 
you can also just like get one that's like their style. The next thing that my roommate Cassidy recommended, and she has gotten this for boyfriends of her past, um, it's like a chain necklace, and then you put like their sports number on it, and apparently it was a big hit. So if you have a guy friend who plays sports, the next idea is a nice wallet. Uh, you could go super expensive and like bougie with this, or you could go less. Another one I'd recommend is cologne, and if you're buying for your boyfriend in specific, go smell them. The one that you like the best, get them that one, because then they're gonna smell like it. Just a little. My next recommendation is over the head headphones. Um, I personally had, I personally have Beats. They are great. They're wireless. Great for the gym, whatever, and I really like them. So this past year, I've become a bit of a gym rat. So I'm gonna give you guys some gift ideas for your gym friends, just because I think I have some ideas for you in that category. So the first thing is a nice water bottle. I highly recommend like a hydro flask or a hydro jug. Um, I've had hydro flasks, love them. They keep your water cold all day. And honestly, this could go for anybody. I've had mine for like four years now use it every day, fantastic things. Um, but they are, they are hydro drugs, which are hold a lot more water and you can take them to the gym. They now have like stainless steel ones, so they're kind of like a hydro class, just bigger. So, great. The next thing for your gym friend is a massage gun, so like for your muscles when they're tense. My next gym suggestion is a gym outfit or gym outfit pieces. Um, I personally have a really cute like top that's like a Lulu lemon like a line top, but I got it from Amazon and I personally really like it. I really should just go buy more colors of it, but I haven't done it yet. And it's really comfortable. So if you're going for a little less expensive, that's a great find. I think it was under 20 bucks, so like great. And then if you wanted to do a little bit more expensive or like more brand brand name, you could do like a Gym Shark or a Lulu Lemon. Um, I'll link some down below. The next suggestion is a nice gym bag. So Gymshark has some really nice ones. I think that's the one Cassidy has right now and um, going strong. She got like a backpack type style gym bag. And then if you want to get some things to go in the gym bag, if they already have one or if you just want to get things that go in the gym bag, you can get them weight clips. So the things that go on the ends of the barbell when you are lifting weights to keep the weights on them. Um, Cassidy got really nice ones from Amazon and I will link them as well. And then I went and bought a barbell pad. So we share. So like when we go to the gym, I pull out my thing and she, we use hers and we share. But um, a nice barbell pad for hip thrusts and that kind of thing. Uh, also, I got mine from Amazon. And honestly, those things, you find them at the gym and a lot of times they're just, you know, not in the best quality or like best state. So um, it's nice to have your own. Now, if your friend is trying to do the social media gym person, you can get them a tripod. Um, like, I would suggest like a smaller tripod that also gets pretty tall um, so that they can record their sets. But also, <laughs> this can kind of be for your influencer friends as well, anybody who likes taking pictures. Um, a lot of times it's easier to take pictures by yourself, but if you don't have to do it, it makes it a little bit more difficult. So if you have a tripod to do it yourself, then like, great, or if they like making TikToks or whatever. So a tripod is a um, great idea. You could also do a protein powder or a pre-workout. Um, I have struggled to find a good protein powder that I really like. I actually am in a little bit of a stalled moment because I'm afraid to buy another one and not like it. But I have tried Cassie's Ghost uh, Oreo protein powder and that is pretty, pretty good. And I have been considering buying it. Again, I'm just a little afraid to go buy one again and like not like it after a while. So it comes in such a big thing. So it would be really nice to receive. Um, so, or if you know somebody has like a powder, like a protein powder that they do like. And if you wanted to get a blender bottle with it or on its own, um, there are little things with the little like metal ball inside so you can like shake up your pre-workout and protein powder drinks. My last idea is sour strips. They are so, so good. <laughs> and there's so many flavors and I think they have them at Target now. But I, other than that, you can just buy them on their site. They are really good. And I recommend them for everybody. <laughs> but they're really good for the gym because they are a 
fast dissolving carbs, so if you need a little energy on the go, they are great to have. I keep mine in my gym bag and I sometimes will eat some at home, and too many at home, but I do keep them in my gym bag and sometimes when I'm feeling a little like, mm, I need something, like I need to up my blood sugar or something, I eat one and then it makes me feel a lot better. So that's kind of what they are for and why they're associated with the gym. So that is everything in my holiday gift guide. And I hope it helped you figure out some things that you wanted to give your friends and family for Christmas or whatever holiday you celebrate. Also, I'm doing Vlogmas again this year, um, starting actually tomorrow. You guys will probably see this the day before I post the first Vlogmas. So, <laughs> I had to refilm it. So anyways, a little plug. If you guys want to watch Vlogmas, it's coming up to so subscribe. Uh, for a video every single day on December. Don't forget to go follow me on Instagram and TikTok and all the other social medias. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.